Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw some tennis shoes. I'm going to go right in the center of my paper and put two fingers and on the left hand side I put one dot and on the right hand side I put another dot. Starting on the left I'm going to draw an oval. Curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And on the right hand side I'm going to draw another oval. Curve line, curve line, curve line up, connect. I come back to the left and I'm going to draw straight line, curve line, and stop. Come on the right hand side, straight line, curve line, and stop. I come back to the left, up at the top, and I'm going to draw a curve line down, curve line in, curve line out, connect, and on the right hand side, I'm going to do it again, I'm going to draw a curve line down, curve line in, curve line out, connect. I'm going to mimic the line I just drew. So I start right about here on the left and I draw a curve line down, over, keep going, up, connect. I come on the right hand side, I'm going to do it again. Curve line down, keep going, up, connect. Now I come from the top and I'm going to draw a curve line over on the left and a curve line over on the right. I come up to the left again and I draw a curve line down on the left and a curve line down on the right. I come inside if you can fit one and I'm just going to draw another curve line mimicking the one on the left. Come over here on the right curve line, mimicking it all the way over, up, connect. I come back to the left and I'm just going to draw curve lines, keep going, all the way up, however many you can fill. If I do it on the left, I'm going to do it on the right, curve lines, all the way up. Now if you leave a space, you can put a loop on the left, a loop on the right, connect, and on the right hand side we're going to do it again, a loop on the left, loop on the right, connect. Now I can put little dotted lines on either side, going down, going down on the right, all the way. Okay, I think that's it. Let's see how we're going to color these in. Now these are pretty simple to color in. I'm going to color the inside black so it looks like the inside of the shoe. And you can color any color you want for your tennis shoe. So for this one I'm going to use red. And I'm going to add a little red line going down and around the edge of my sole. So I'm going to color this one red. And I'm going to add that little red line going down across the sole. You can use purple, you can blue, you can use red, yellow, it's your choice. Okay, let's see what these look like all colored in. Here are my tennis shoes all colored in, ready to go play basketball or maybe for the first day of school. Okay, bye bye.